Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to answer this question and perform a demo. How to add custom code in SSRS report? First of all, why we need the custom code? There are possibilities when we do not have some functions in SSRS report or maybe there are complex expressions that we have to write and instead of writing those complex expression every time we would like to write some function and use in our SSRS report. So let's go ahead and take a look. Here I have a report that uh, is displaying sale person first name last name region and country what I would like to do I would like to create a function that can take first name and last name and concatenate together and give me full name so I have written a code of a function that can uh, the name of the function is called string concat and it can accept uh, two parameters uh, so you can see that uh, a string one and a string two and it's a returning string uh, and then I have a uh, declare a variable dim full string as a string type now full string is equal to string one and then I have added some space between that and a plus string two so that's how I'm cr creating this uh, full string value by using these parameter values and then I'm returning the full string and that's the end of function if I would like to use this function in SSRS how I can do that first of all if you see the function here this can be done in expressions so this is just for the example you can create complex functions and let's go ahead and use this one so go to design you will be going to report then go into the report properties and here we will see the code and uh, that's where we will be pasting our uh, code whatever we have written if I will cl right click here there is no paste option so I have to use a control V that will paste my code here and hit OK now we will be coming back to the sorry design again and then uh, let's go ahead and add a new column insert and write now here we will be going to the expressions right click go to expression now we will be using our code so we will write code and then we have to provide the name of the function in our case as we know that it is a string concat so I'm gonna copy this one so let's go back here control V and as you know that it accept two parameters or arguments so you are gonna to go to the fields and here we will be using sale person first name and sale person last name so that's what I will be using and then parenthesis is closed you see that there is a red line under this function here that doesn't really matter uh, it will work just fine so hit ok now we can give a name to this column say full name and preview and you can see that it concatenated the first name and the last name you can concatenate anything actually uh, as let's say we would like to concatenate country and region by using the same function we can use that because it is accepting two parameters as you can pass country and region field and it will concatenate and maybe we can call that one full address so the goal was to tell you how to use the the custom code in SSRS you are will be going to report and report properties and from there you will be going to code and pasting your code there once you have the code there you will be coming back to the expressions and then using code dot your function name and passing the arguments thanks very much for watching this video and I will see you guys in next video